I'm the Empire Void, this is Rampain, and welcome back to my Dark Iron 12's campaign, where we're going to continue the problem last time. So, we're still trying to push oh. our forces into the heart of Cosmodan's fort lands, seeing as how we kind of got them on the run. They don't have much, we just have to go into Dunmuro, and let's see, they got a few stragglers out here, which I'll probably try and finish off. So you guys can just auto-resolve you guys to death. Yeah. Ooh, another man of the hour, Captain Thra. Sure, I'll take you. You can always use more random the day generals. Is ours. The enemy are beaten. So definitely more governors. Uh, there hasn't been anything new on the general front in the Excel sheet. Again, if you guys want a character and you want to give them uh, any sort of tasks, let me know. Just put it in the Excel sheet, and I'll make sure I try and get your character uh, a army and try and fulfill their goals. Uh, at the moment, I'm probably going to just take this dude. Let's have you become the governor of Moonkrash. You do that, and then you... You can return quite a few guys. I want to try and do that before I have you head out. So I'm going to move you guys over to Dun al Gaz. And kind of gather these guys together, retrain a little bit, and I will be moving you guys forward. Now, where is my glorified watchtower builder? Where, oh, where is uh, I was again? Rogar suit skin. That's the one I want. He is. So I kind of want to have him go forward and put a watchtower between me and. Oh, he's currently in Syrian Gorge. So I kind of want to have you come this way and put a watchtower right yes. there. Friend, I'm always willing well, are you to trying to trade with my enemies? Let's see. Do I need to build really. And get the workshop. I'll get that, I guess, right now. Just to keep building stuff. I need to. I can't wait until I get to the very high end construction of uh, these buildings. Because that's the, still the thing that I dislike the most about this mod. It takes so long to build up my lands um, to where I have all the unit production I really, really want. But once I do, I can just imagine some of the armies I'm going to be building in this campaign. Because of what we've seen at Thelsamar. I, oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. Okay, you're attacking me outside. What is in this army? Guns, guns, and cap. And you guys have guns, 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 infantry. I almost think I could win this. Honestly, I'm gonna try it. Let's try and fight this. I, I want to see how this goes. Because if I played this right, the main problem is going to be the Bronze Beard Elders. But, yeah, no. I, I, well, we have this about the same amount of ranged units. So let me see. I got my dudes. We will be going up the hill. And if anything, I can try and just run away as well. But we'll try and get as many kills as we possibly can with my... Uh, skirmishers first, and then I'll try and have it so that my cavalry will just try and kill their skirmishers. Because that's the main thing. I have a cab unit. They don't. They're still taking their time, but this is actually something I wanted to bring up that I was just thinking about while I'm waiting. I would love if this mod had a sub-mod that went to Outland. This is entirely just because I watched the uh, 2020 um, Enter into like Black Rock trailer from Thunder something a robber or whatnot, and I just thought that was just something that's been on my mind since I watched that right before playing this. It's just like, okay, that that's dope. Could we actually like do that though? That'd be amazing going into Outland for a uh, like a sub mod for this. I think that'd be great. We already have the Naga. Are you the Blood Elves? Uh, technically, you just don't have the main followers. Well, technically, you kind of like the Dark Lord. Are you not hitting them? You say you're in range, but you're not hitting me. Oh, now you are. There you go. And yeah, now they're starting to die. Yes, follow my cav. Follow my cav unit. Oh, that's a dwarven rifleman. I did not see you guys an issue like that. And honestly, we're going to fight here for a little bit. Actually, no, back out. 
Back out, back out. You did the damage you needed to that unit. Only half the enemy force remains. Ah, look at that. Come on, run out of Go for the rifleman. Don't get stuck on the rock. Just keep running around in front of them. Let my riflemen keep doing their job. Because now they're in that nice sweet spot. You guys aren't doing much. So the Iron Star shooters aren't the greatest. I still think the Iron Star sharp shooters are better. Because what's the difference in your stats? Yeah, technically these guys are better. Uh, but I don't think so. The, these sharp shooters are way better. Like, can you specifically target this unit and actually do something to it? Charge this elder's unit. I want to stop them from gaining my units. Come on. Stop. 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 Nope, just gonna ignore me. I pray the course of this battle changes because defeat seems almost. I almost certain. killed all of them. There are not that many left, so it's just mainly the elders. Let's have you guys adjust. You know, I love these sharpshooters. These sharpshooters are great. You guys suck. <laughs> the Iron Star shooters do suck. You guys are almost out of ammunition, which isn't the best. But no, I've... It's just this unit here. That's the thing. I need you guys to start opening fire on them now while you've got the chance. These guys are holding. They just don't do much damage to them. Our men have fought long and are, beco and are becoming tired. Come on, please. They're just almost out of ammo. Gonna try and go after my cavalry, aren't you? It's only 41 of you left, damn it! For the moment, the Fortuna battle goes our way. What are they way. doing? They're just running Let's away. Pray it remains as such. Yeah, no, this sharpshoot, fucking amazing, absolutely amazing. We are blessed. The enemy general's dead. dead. We have and you guys finish him off. Uh, yeah, we've won this, because you guys are just sitting there, letting me shoot you. I might just run out of ammo. That's, like, the one thing I'm worried about. But no, imagine, like, six or seven of these guys. I almost want an army of them. Actually, it's... I'm kind of almost tempted, because I saw Eric Carthage doing his uh, Warhammer campaign, um, where he's just playing the Empire with just guns. Our kind of tempted to do that with these guys. The Lord wow, look at that. Our foe has been much humbled. Damn. Remember this day. Remember Never, it as the day of our ever most recruiting the Iron Star victory. shooters ever again. The sharpshooters blew them out of the goddamn water. Absolutely blew them out of the goddamn water. Look at that. That is beautiful. I want more of them now. I want an army of them, and I want to see what an army of them would do. So what's the difference in their upkeep? Because I think it's 100. New mission, take uh, settlement, uh, counter us. I can do that. Yes. Yeah, you guys cost, yeah, 300. There's no reason. Honestly, fuck this unit. Fuck the Iron Star shooters. The sharpshooters are so much better. Technically, you get these guys earlier, but... The sharpshooters are just far better. Far superior. Love them. Can't hide effective against armor, bonus in deserts, long range missiles. Because these guys just don't have that long range missile. These guys, I think it's because these guys do. That's why they're so powerful. I fucking love it. I fucking love it. Okay, keep retraining those guys. And... I am just kind of waiting until I have a proper army to be able to sally out and move out against the enemy. Let's see, do you guys have... Yeah, let's, let's just do this. You go in there, merge. You guys join in. Oh, wait, what? You already had two slots, and then... Were you not able to merge with them? Oh, those are steel. Oh, okay, just get rid of this one. Oops, okay. That's what was going on. 
Um, yeah, keep getting that. I can't get the better... No, I can't get the better stables right now. God damn it. Well, that's fine, but I really want to retrain those steel breakers. You guys do get the Hall of Warriors. If anything, I want more sharpshooters. I am going to recruit more of these guys. I'm, gonna, I'm honestly tempted to get an army of just them. Do the steel breakers here, so I can retrain the steel breakers in the castle. Let's get rid of the shooters. But yeah, we can fucking all of them. There's no reason for me to use them. I'm basically only ever going to use uh, the sharpshooters or the crossbowmen. The crossbowmen are pretty decent because um, they're cheaper, aren't they? Yeah. Well, that unit's not at full upkeep, but or full strength, but it, it also gets free upkeep. That's another yes. bonus to the crossbowmen because um, the sharpshooters don't get free upkeep, which kind of sucks. Uh, let's see if you get the better plate. You guys... Okay, just upgrade the armor. I'm just trying to continuously develop my lands. And then just to focus my cities on growth. Because you're at 11,000, 3% per turn. And you don't get anything more from that. It'll be a couple turns until you're ready. Thrissian is getting there. They're growing at uh, the same rate, but they have a few more guys already. You know, I think I just want to get a few more uh, sharpshooters, and then I'll have these guys move out. I'm just trying to retrain as many as possible. I hate that you can't retrain the sharpshooters in this city just yet. Oh, it's not even at the 10,000 point. Oh, okay, that's why. I need to try and get some more map information, because I don't have any other missions, do I? No, it's just that one. So let's try and go north, and I'll try and just get map information from other factions. Okay. The fools oh yes, come on, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Just assault me. I don't care. Attack me at Thessalmar, goddammit. Do it. Do it. God, every time I see them attacking one of my cities, I'm like, just do it already. Just attack me. I want them to attack me so fucking badly. Like, I might honestly just try and walk around them with my forces. Like, I've got the guys around here. I think I'm honestly just going to take you guys and just move them around the city. So it's a couple of you guys, because they're ignoring yes. me right now at Mokosh. Um, so let's grab you guys, move you together. And, uh, you guys can retrain them here. I'll grab a few guys that are already full strength. So boom, 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 boom. Yes. Yes. Boom. Orders. You guys. Is 55 the max? Yeah, 55 is the max for you guys. So you, yes. you are also full. Um, let's grab... Yes. We have plenty of cavalry. We need more ranged units. So, honestly, it's basically all of you yes. guys. That's a good force. Okay, and then I'll probably have it so that... You're supposed to be the glorified watchtower builder, but I don't want you to die, so let's have you start watching, uh, building watchtowers over here first. And then, uh... Thamorak Grimbrew is actually a character right now, and that is currently Gabby. So I'll have Gabby still kind of control this army, and I'll let them leave the front. I'll paint three more dudes that'll grab... Want more sharpshooters? You guys can't recruit them. My castles can. My castles can recruit uh, sharpshooters right now. So I'm gonna have you guys spam a few of those. I'll try and grab them. Basically, just fill up the rest of. Ooh, the I don't remember. Fill up the rest of these slots with just sharpshooters because I've got four of them. I want yes. more. I want more of them yet. See, I think that's it for now. So end the turn again. Leaving the army, my lord. Of that guy that was going to Mogrash. I'll have him go up into the dam. I'll have him be the governor of that settlement now. Since I'm moving Gabby's character out to lead the assault against um, Kazadum. I better not be missing, mixing up the goddamn dwarves again. Then again, it's 1 a.m. I'm recording right now when I shouldn't be right now. I should be sleeping, but I have a horrible fucking sleep schedule. I'm staying up until 3 fucking a.m. every fucking day. 
I will defeat you honorably, my worthy foe. God will see I, justice I need to in check our this battles. myself. Casmo Dan. Ah, mixing up the fucking dwarves. Ah, there's so many dwarves. So many dwarves. And you go up to the dam. We cannot travel there. And then let's see any dwarves over here. Yes. Let's have you go around. Uh, hi, Lord Orlan. Do you wanna wanna chat, Lord Orlan? What do you want, Lord Orlan? Um, I'll tell you go around and please stealth. Nope, you're not doing that. Okay. Okay, now keep grabbing these guys because I want to bring these sharpshooters yes. forward. I had what three slots? Yeah, three slots. On, I will defeat you honorably, my word. Fucking do it. Come on, I need, to, I need to not talk too loudly. Everybody's trying to sleep. <laughs> but I, I need to finish this recording no, now before it's forget, because otherwise I don't do that for early in the morning. I don't want to do that. Uh, just get the leather tanner. Leather tanner. Uh, Firewatch, Blacksmith, I'm just upgrading all the armor right now, because I can't get these guys to the max level city just yet, it's taking a while. It's taking way too goddamn long. Uh, Ram Stables. Yeah, Ram Stables. Come on, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. That's not what I meant. Hey, it's King Magni, am I gonna kill fucking Magni now too? Because of bullshit? I might. It's a bodyguard. Yeah, Siege Breakers. And then what's in... Thargus Envenmar. Hey, the realm I play all the time on. Ah, uh, okay. Bunch of generic infantry. Okay. Okay. Let's not get Gabby killed. <laughs> but I think we can do this. Let me just... I'm hoping we actually have a pretty nice hill right now. Because we got got quite a bit of generic infantry, which I'm not too worried about. I'm about to kill fucking Magni, too. Let's see... Um, enemy reinforcements should be from over this this way. Right? Yeah, I think from the orientation that's where they should be coming from. And that's the main force. I think actually we're gonna do you guys. I have you. You guys are actually quick enough that I think I can honestly kind of let you. I should try the checkerboard formation. I should do the checkerboard formation. It works better. Uh, let's move you guys over just a little bit. You right there. You guys can tell I'm not cutting as much out right now because of the fact that I'm just, it's more difficult right for me right now to actually keep track of my uh, current time of how long I've been playing for. So we're just gonna not give a fuck about that. Um, so, so basically what I'm gonna do is hope that all my skirmishers will focus fire uh, Magni down. And then I will actually have you guys turn your attention um, over to the rest of the forces. But I just want my skirmishers to try and kill them all first. That's kind of my goal. Is you guys kind of do that. I might actually have you guys just initially aimed this way. Yeah, I'll just do that. Because they should be coming from that direction. So I want to just try and destroy Magni as quickly as possible. The enemy ah, are bringing in coming from the different direction. They're coming in from over here. So you guys move up that way. And to get to your allies... Uh, hey, a uh, dude. You're attacking me! Okay, let's have my cavalry rush over here. They're just a bunch of skirmishers, so I can just run them down pretty easily. It's just that siege tank. That's the one thing I'm worried about. Although you guys should start firing. Because I think I actually have uh, the range on these guys. Yep, my sharpshooters have the range. Fuck yeah. Let's kind of run around this way. God, I love these sharpshooters. Absolutely love these sharpshooters. Hey, you guys start moving in position a little faster. Because they're right down there. There goes my warlocks. They're opening fire too. Five percent. Okay, you guys do that. Open fire on them. And then where's the siege tank thing? Oh, there it is. Yeah, focus the sea steam engine. 
Only you guys half use fire the enemy on that. force remains. But yeah, you guys just charge into this. Charge into the uh, riflemen. And then there's the other guys. And you guys shoot into Magnus. Uh, can you stop dying? I don't want to get Gabby killed, damn it. Oh, you guys hurt. You guys fucking it is hurt. Wise to praise the day before sunset, but oh, our men are winning the so battle painful. and forging Just a worthy brutes. victory. It's gonna kill Magni. Come on, dude. Steam engine isn't dead yet. Number wise, eight to thirteen, not the best. Uh, I am gonna have you guys adjust your fire. You're gonna kind of go over this way. Um, all of you guys, uh, or not? Please kill this fucking steam engine. I don't care if you need to skirmish. Uh, this thing needs to die. Like now. Shoot it. Shoot it. Fill it full of holes, please. This is not going too well, guys. I should have been paying attention. Oh, that was the Magnet. Someone's dead. Four more of his bodyguard. God. Die, you damn steam engine. There, he's dead. Thank God. Okay, you guys, let's adjust you. Let's kind of bring you all over here. To praise that way we can open fire on these guys here. Our men are winning because right now, all of their dudes feel like they are victory. losing. And then once I've got you guys dealt with... Wait, it's two left. Okay, one left. That's Magni right there. Once he's dead, I'll be able to easily just walk around here with my cavalry and just start... Rear charging you guys. And they'll break pretty easily. Oh, you guys took a lot of damage. Okay, actually, you guys need to be a little closer. You're not as long range as everybody else. So run over there. 24 to 23. It's pretty damn even number wise. But now Magni's pretty much dead. That's the main thing. Is his bodyguard. It's a brutal fucking bodyguard. Come on, there's the a guy. There we go. Slain by our it is on the King Magni is now the day dead. Sunset, but our men Let's have you guys up this way. Forging a worthy victory. You guys kind of flank around. I'll start finishing this unit off. That was a horrible charge. Guys, fight me. Fight me! I said fight me, damn it. Okay, you guys go there. Um, you're gonna open fire. You are not gonna fire. Let's bring you a little closer. And you guys are pushing you up a little too. What are you hitting? Oh, I guess there was an infantry unit that I was trying to flank around. Uh, no. No, no, no. I don't think so. Are you going to get to my uh, skirmishers? I would hope not. How the hell are you not broken yet? How are you guys doing? Uh, 14, almost dead. There we go. Now we're starting to fall in my favor. The ogres are still doing a bit of damage. I'm going to tell my warlocks to focus them. Yeah, these dudes are dead. Uh, nice crisp dwarf. Actually, you guys might be a better on this unit. Let's move you guys up again. Kind of right here. Cavalry, you're finally done over there. Okay, let's get you guys into position. And we'll start flanking in these guys. We're folding in on these guys. So I don't know who the general is for this army. He's right... here... Oh, oh, he's actually a bodyguard. Yeah, right there. Um, yeah, blanket the hell out of that guy with uh, just a skirmish fire. Kill him. 
I forgot that there's another one of that unit on this fucking map. Jesus. Okay. I need to start breaking the guys, though. Because my men are holding decently in melee. They are starting to waver a little. I think a good charge into some of their flanks. Should do wonders. Broken it. Wavering. I kind of feel bad about if I was going to just be slaughtering Magni with an auto-resolve. Um, because we were winning the battle, and sometimes if I'm winning, I just do the auto-win. But I'm just going to withdraw, and they thankfully let me get away. Um, so instead... Yes. I, I hate that they didn't bring everybody. Like, you could have brought Thag uh, Thargus and Vomar over there too. But no, you guys didn't want to bring him with... So I'll just have to kill just Vandar Stormpike alone. I'm sorry, guys. Oh, yeah. Fall the Horde! I wish Dark Iron were on the Horde. That'd be fucking amazing. Just, I love the heavy metal dwarves. I just don't like Alliance at all. And I, the Dark Iron dwarves are making me like, oh, do I want to play the Alliance at times? Let's see. So everybody get off the fucking walls. Okay, we got most of my guys chilling on the walls. And this is gonna be fun. Absolutely fun. Because you guys just immediately start focusing down the towers now that I know you guys can destroy them, which I find fucking amazing. It doesn't matter if I have siege towers or not. I'm just gonna just fucking destroy them. Yep. Glory to God. The enemy siege tower Get the destroyed. ram too. Although maybe I should let them actually break down the gates a little bit. Let's get closer before I destroy everything. Yeah, let's have you guys get closer just before I destroy everything. They technically do have the ladders. And right now I'm just gonna have my wife in the middle of the on that there. These you guys should honestly probably break. And so they've already lost 9% of their forces. Kind of direct your attention further back. There we go. 13, 16, 17, 18, 19. Our enemy's ladders have reached our walls. It is time for butcher's work. Uh, we're kind of already doing the butcher's work right now. Well, I don't know if this, this isn't the, it's the butcher's work and not the butcher's work at the same time. Because I'm just, I'm bur I'm cooking them. So we're kind of skipping a step. This is so disgusting. We are it. blessed. The enemy there goes Vandar Stormpike. He didn't hear about the dragon's end. breath the last time. The enemy time. are badly bloody. They have lost half their men. <laughs> oh, are they actually trying to all go up the ladders? Oh, they are. Oh, oh, you, you, you poor, poor fool. You can try that if you really, really want. I would advise against it as I adjust my dudes. And uh, I don't think you should do that. Guys. You guys can try and get on the walls the here. In our if you really want. I'm going to kill 69% of your forces. Victory and um, uh, yeah, these guys aren't even on the walls yet. I even could have just left them out. So actually, go over here. Oh my God. I don't. I don't know. Can you guys hear that thunder? It is it's a lot of uh, thunderstorm going on right sunset. now. But oh God, this might destroy me. And if I fire into here, forging a worthy victory. Nah, I don't even need to. You guys are just giving up on the walls. Okay, well I'll see you guys when the campaign. We'll destroy them here. Oh god. Praise the Almighty! Our oh my enemy god. has lost his stomach to fight! I, that actually was like a jump scare for me. <laughs> I'm really happy about it. Above, our foe has been much humbled. Let all I need who remember this day, day. Just day. Remember it as the day. Oh my god. I was like, oh, these guys won't just automatically fire. That's, uh, they're not gonna do that. They're not gonna hit my own men. And then they do. Ah! Okay. Ah, hi, Lordaeron. Hi. Okay, so I am going to have to ignore them for the moment. 
Um, I kind of need to focus on... Sponsor Militia. I should be fine. Sponsor Militia. And I am gonna see. No more words. Throw your sword. Good orders, number one. I don't want you to leave just yet. No, I want you to grab those guys first. So we'll bring you back this yes. way. Now let's grab all these riflemen. So you have a full army. Then I'm going to use you to push west. First and foremost, we focus our dwarven uh, uh, brethren. Um, they're the top priority. I'm going to hold off Lordaeron, and I'm not going to worry about them for the mo moment. Uh, nothing else to build. It's really for the market. For growth, I mean. Because that's still the top priority, just growing a settlement as quickly as possible if I have anything for it. Although, that's, yeah, that's public order. Well, happiness. Okay, well, yeah, no. Get, keep giving me more sharpshooters. I want more of them. Also, I'll have you just send people over this way too, honestly. Because at the moment... I'm getting more, I mean, how much money am I making? Eh, not a ton. Can't, can't have too much. Jesus, that's loud. Fuck. That's actually going to be really nice to fall asleep to. Like, honestly, I love falling asleep to the rain and thunder. It's just a wonderful sound. You guys, let's get you ready. Yep, get the cavalry first. Cavalry in the dam. There's nothing for me to build, is there? Eh, I can get the workshop. There's, there's nothing for me to really do with the workshop, but I'll grab it. Um, and then you guys are siege. There's nothing for me to do here. I'll just queue that up, I guess. Name the now, all of you start pushing into... I don't... Do I have a spy? Agents. We've got you, Sire. you and all that. Okay, you go this way. I just so we kind of know the actual army sizes of those settlements. They backed off? Okay. I'm okay with them backing off, done, I'll guys. Uh, Strong Guard wants ceasefire. Sure. You're not asking for anything, so might as well accept it for now. Because I just want to focus on the, uh, the other dwarves. Those are that's my top priority right now. Is I don't care about anybody else besides them. So I'm gonna start walking this way. And ignore you guys and just keep walking this way. And then let me grab my spy. And I need to see a city so I can actually see how many dudes that got in each one. I want one of these settlements to actually get to the next level. It's gonna be Thrasian if anything. You guys are the ones that are growing the fastest. And you guys have the highest population, so they'll probably be the first one. Thelsimar is... Hey, they're actually growing at a pretty good, good rate. Get that. Because I hate how limited I am on my troops. I just want more of the Molten Fist Mages. That's the main thing. I really, really like the Sharpshooters, but they're, they're not Molten Fists. They're not. This unit I fucking love the most. I'd say that's my favorite unit right now. Second favorite's the sharpshooters. And I don't know. The enemy and stone guard are a pretty nice melee unit. The infantry I'm not as keen on for these guys. Not nearly as much as other factions. But I, I do really like their skirmishers. That's honestly my favorite part about them. And if anything, I'm okay, this is just a very random tangent because I'm just thinking about uh, a Magni. Now, I, at least I'll probably be able to give him a proper death. Um, just because, thanks game for crashing. We are under siege. So that's kind of a wasted battle, lives. sadly. But we'll be able to face him on the field of battle and maybe uh, have to give him a proper death. I don't know where the hell he went. He just disappeared. He's like, oh, I saw a flash of my death. I should, I must avoid this at all costs. Okay, so there's re-siege done on gas. I should have tried to recruit some more rifles there. I have just infantry. Can't really build nothing. Just, I'm just building random shit right now because you guys aren't growing. Oh, you actually might grow soon. So actually pay attention. Uh, get the archaeological dig because those actually do matter. Um, get, get the upgraded town guard. I should have gotten that for a, wh a while ago for you guys. You guys, you're getting like what, 500 per day or per turn. Keeping the extraction. Another dinner. There's just like nothing to fucking build. Uh, I'm just building the same random ass fucking things. Are you guys just gonna let me march into your lands? 
to battle. Guess what I am. I must Let's see. So, yeah, there's like. Oh. Ah, we can actually get in there. Belgon Flamebeard. Your orders, number one. Can I get to Kenanos this With turn? God's blessing and yours, we march to uh -huh. Aha! Oh, gates are open. We thank you for delivering us. Damn. Your orders, number are they just gonna leave me alone now and just let me do this? You're just sitting there. Done. They're ignoring me at Thelsamar, which is okay with me because it lets me retrain my dudes. Because I do need to retrain them. Let's see. So I'm just use, yep, yep. Oh wow, who's the richest? Okay, so it's actually the Blood Elves are the richest. Aren't they just one settlement right now? Next turn we'll find out because I'm going to do another map reveal. So we can look at that. Looks like Stormwind and the Burning Legion have a piece. It's kind of weird. Approaching, my lord. Camping here, my lord. Okay. It seems uh, to much to sure. Bless you for You attacked me. It has been a pleasure. Do I have a piece with the uh, Stormwind right now? I don't think I do. Because after uh, Chasmodan, either I'm going to go north into Lordaeron and Stormgod, or I'm going to go south into Stormwind. Um, honestly, what do you guys think? Do you think I should go north first, or do you think I should go south first? Because what I could do is basically... Well, actually, let's do the map reveal. This is going to give me an idea of like, what we're talking about. Because if... Technically, either way, my dwarven allies are still up here. So we could go up north. Because let's see, right now, nothing... <sighs> Northrend never really changes. Nothing ever really happens in Northrend. Things are very interesting over here. Oh, the Blood Elves might lose the Sunwell. You are not the one I will answer Prince Alstan... Uh, oh my god. Altasor... Scar is holding them back, but they only have their singular settlement. I don't see. Um. Oh, there they are. Now it's uh, Dark One Yosef. <laughs> I love the just random names of Joe, basically. So the Forsaken are almost dead. They, they have like nothing left. Uh, they should go to Fenris. If they want to survive, they should go to Fenris. Um, otherwise, oh, actually, what was that about? Uh, yeah, there's just three times. Okay. Horde really haven't expanded much. You guys haven't expanded much. Not much has changed since the last time we looked. Um, Storm is doing very well for themselves down here. They really are. And just, again, yeah, once I'm done with the dwarves, it's either I'm going to go north, because later on. Uh, okay, they're kind of doing decently for themselves. Lordaeron's doing decently. Yeah, not a whole lot has changed since I last looked at the map. Right, you guys just have to let me know. Do you think I should go north or south after I finish off the other quarters? Yes. Uh, oh, you're supposed to be moving on. Stop by there for a second. Yes. Okay, you guys keep grouping up there. Got some order. Uh, get the dig. And just keep her training. Thank you guys. Hi! Will be with us, man. Oh, they actually have pretty chance for themselves. Oh, it's because of the bodyguard you've got. Ah, yeah. I might have to kill him. Just shoot him full of holes. We do have the gates open, so I'm actually going to quickly fight this. Let's have this be the last thing we do today. Because I think this should be pretty quick. What I'm going to do is I will take my rangers, uh, or my sharpshooters. I'm going to have them kind of line up since I think I have range superiority. I can just unload on the guys on the walls, and then I'll just have my cavalry running. So, cavalry... Three of you. So you guys start up over here. There you go. And I've got a lot of you guys. Yay! Got seven of them. So you guys honestly... Oh wow, actually that's almost maybe perfect to like that. No, not the group of Actually, all of my infantry. I'm actually gonna have you guys just pull back. I don't think I'm gonna need you, honestly. You stand there. And then actually, maybe just a little further back. I need to gauge how far the enemy can shoot. And how far the enemy I can shoot. In reinforcements. 
So you guys, let's move over just a little bit. Kind of gauge how close we have to get. And uh, cavalry, um, you're just gonna walk in. Oh wait, actually, all the guys are over here. They ignored me. Oh. That completely defeats the purpose of me wanting to shoot them. God damn it. Well, we can just run onto the walls, I guess. You guys do that, I guess. Kind of defeats the purpose of me having my cavalry there. It's just, just a little bit. Um, and it seems like their reinforcements are actually going to try and run in this way. You guys can drop all of your siege equipment. I need you guys to hold it. You guys... Oh, now they're moving their guys over. Um... Hold that order now that they're doing that. Because our towers are active. Fuckers, make up your mind on what you're doing. Are you going to run and kill me on the walls? Or what the hell? You guys run over here. That's what I'm going to do for sure, though. You guys kind of line up here so we can meet those guys that are reinforcing. Now you're just standing there. You're just fucking standing there. Of course. Uh, you guys see fire, right? You're just Give wasting grace to God. We have a captured the enemy. You just rush in. And is it just the one dude here? Yeah. Cavalry, just go run and kill him. Oh, please don't die. The battle is in our favor. So if we remain true and hold very, our very feet, bad. victory will be ours. Or he's just gonna run to meet me and fight me in melee. Okay. <laughs> okay. I'm okay with that. Uh, you guys wanna run over here? Also, I can't remember if these guys can uh, shoot over you or if they need clear line of sight. If they can shoot over, kind of technically over my dudes, uh, these guys are the best arch range shooter in the game. Let's see. Okay. Hitting them is the question. Oh wow, that's an interesting line. What the hell are you guys doing? Just spread out. I guess if you guys have too many lines, kind of act a little derpy. So it does not seem like they can actually deal damage like that. Oh, uh, you guys can shoot these guys. Ah, uh, let's go and engage them. So I'm just gonna have you guys start flanking around it. Can go around here. And you guys, once they're engaged, perfect. Not there. How are you guys doing? You're losing that, it seems. You guys almost done with this unit? One left. Praise to our lord! Come on. Our men have slain the enemy general. That should be the reinforcing general. Now his men will lose heart. Yep, that's the reinforcing general. The main general is now dead too. And since it's taking me 20 minutes to capture it, Praise I'm just gonna ignore it. Our men and I'm just gonna bring you guys over here to help city. out with these guys. And then the you guys now just need to kill the guys that are actually outside they have lost still. Half their men. That's basically all we're waiting on. We have lost control of the city. I could send like my general, but I'm just gonna have them kill everybody now. That's what we're gonna focus on. 67, almost done. It's just these guys here. It's just the it's just the elders. It's always the elders. Because these guys right here. Actually, you guys can just start running inside to help out. There's just a few guys over here. Oh, you guys already are. Perfect. There we go. The Elgon Flame Beard has lost the settlement to us. And now we're properly in the homeland. You can tell I never am over in these areas in normal now because I always just replace the names with other things so I don't have to actually say the name so I can look it up later. Oh yes, it's done with Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, just retry start retraining these guys. And you guys, also not at rank at the 18,000 mark. Of course. Well, we can work on the growth. Get that started. 
and they gave me some money. But I think this is going to be where we're going to end the video for now. Now we've got Karanos. We just have a few more settlements left. Uh, like, we have to take Nomergon. I think there's two more settlements up here. Oh, yeah, there's also Anvilmar, and then I think it should be Iron Forge up here. So just three more settlements, and they'll be dead. And yeah, just let me know. What do you guys think? Should I go north, or should I go south once I finish off the dwarves? But I'm going to end this for now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, maybe like, comment, and or subscribe. If you guys did not, please let me know why so I can try and improve. Also check out my Discord. It's a great way to interact with the rest of my community and get updates on videos. Additionally, there are plenty of other ways to continue to support my channel in the description, so you can check that out. This is Rampant, and I'll see you guys next time.